Oh, we have a good time, Peter. Don't we? Don't we? We just, we just get along. This us. <laughs> Absolutely. Little girl, little girl, what possessed you to come here at this studio to shoot all this? Oh. Is this your first time on camera? <laughs> It's the it's the smiling. The smiling. It's the smiling to me. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Going down shoe. Trixie Mattel. Sorry I haven't cleaned the room yet. I was too busy having a baby in the basement. Katya. And welcome to uh, the show where we talk about whatever we want. Because it's our show. And not yours. Welcome to our hotel. Oh, and a special tag. Don't forget to watch the Trixie Motel on Discovery Plus in 2022. Another OnlyFans? Mm -hmm. Jesus Me Christ. Me in every room. No, 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 I mean. Gooning and baiting. Gooning and baiting at the, in the, mo in the low. Gooning and baiting launch. at the Target. Yeah. Oh, Ampo, 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 Ampo. Oh, oh, hotels oh. and motels. Hotels. hotels. Wait, this is almost bellboy energy. Coming out of the elevator. Coming out of the elevator. Going up the elevator, pressing the button. Today we have arrived at a topic that you and I actually know quite a bit about. Quite a bit, darling. We have comprehensive knowledge, firsthand experience, a lot of miles. So you worked at the Holiday Inn. Mm -hmm. Restaurant. Restaurant, and Breakfast. you were bringing food to their rooms. Yes, bring a tray up. I would go to the door and every time, I think I was probably 14 or 15 was my first job. Every time I just, I wanted, I dreamed. I wanted a man to answer in a bathroom. Go, you don't have to go. That was undone and have this huge, hard, hairy poke through and give me that look that says, you can leave the food at the door. Yeah, put that tray down. We have other business to attend to. Oh no, I meant leave the food at the door and go away. <laughs> you were 15? 15 And you wanted old. these old men to have sex with you? Absolutely. I, I think yeah. that's wrong. I mean, I never got it, which is, you know, good and legal. Um, but no, hotels, mama, I, I love them all. I love them all. I love it. I Every love it. Hotel. Nothing, I, I get the sleep of my life. Always. It's a fresh start. Every day is a new opportunity to become a new person. Do you, <laughs> do you know what I love the most on tour? What? When you have a day off where everyone gets off the tour bus and you get a room. Mm -hmm. So not only do you get to go in the hotel, but you know you don't have to get up early the next day sleeping in at a hotel. Oh, not to mention, baby. when I tell you, this is what I'm doing at a hotel. What are you Thanks. Doing? Checking in. Put the bag down. Lock the door. <laughs> Immediate, immediate. Why is hotels, motels about f***ing off? I mean, it's literally just a, a sanctum of a. I've got privacy. I've got privacy. I've got privacy. Yeah, and the uh, the way I mean, I'm ruining towels. Oh, you I'm wiping my ass with towels. <laughs> Toilet paper is a suggestion. I don't live here. I'm taking baths. I don't even need the room to have four walls, but I need a bathtub. I had a bathtub in the bedroom at, in my Las Vegas hotel. I had that too. Yeah, yeah we were there. It was the same gig. Did yeah. you use it? Are you kidding me? I off straight down that drain. I was on the ledge, uh, then I was in the water. Oh, gotta get back on the ledge. Yep, yep. and then woo. I did the porn thing where I I was <laughs> the drain hole and I pulled out and <laughs> on the drain hole. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's me though. Very me. <laughs> Very me. One time I stayed at the Axel Hotel in Berlin, Germany. Uh -huh. Didn't know it was a hookup hotel. Black walls, black hallways, and the shower light was red. That's gross. An old man tried to <laughs> me off on the roof. <laughs> What's the address? <laughs> I, mean, what? I was traveling what doing abroad there? alone. Where? Why? After Drag Race. Oh, after Drag Race. Do you remember how I was like the first queen from season seven to go to abroad? To go to Germany. But I didn't have an assistant for years. Right. So everyone else had a posse. I'm alone in Germany with three suitcases. Oops, sorry. And I'm on the roof and I don't realize I'm too naive. Mm. So With a, your a hot tub hard. and an old man comes and gets in it. And then he's talking to me and I'm like, yeah, ha, ha. And then he tried to put, he puts his hand on my leg and goes, is this okay? And you know what I said? You said yes. yes. Oh, because geez. I was too scared to say no. I know. Now, the new me. What would you do? Would my you own do? boyfriend has to ask if it's okay because <laughs> Cobra Kai. I saw Cobra Kai and no one's safe. Okay, let me paint a picture for you. Hong Kong. We arrive via black car. A concierge for each of us. 
And we go up to the top floor of this hotel. You go to the top floor. The room and you was jump <laughs> off the. <laughs> the bathroom was bigger than the blue banana. I'm talking like the bathroom was literally the size of this room. The shower was um, multi uh, thing, like whatever you call those heads, and then heads on the wall. I see that you're unfamiliar with a shower. <laughs> what do you call it? The shower heads. What do you call them? The heads of a shower? Then a huge cloth for tub sat in the center of another portion of the bathroom. With the click of a button, the three windows that um, faced the harbor in the ocean were frosted in a matter of moments. Mary, this f hotel. I was there, you know how many nights I was there? One. One night in paradise. Well, after one night, they were like, we gotta get this out of here. Get the stretcher. I could wiggle down two floors to a gorgeous tropical smoking patio where we were, where I enjoyed where the you company and of a other monkey guests. and a dolphin just. <laughs> Nay, how about this though? The, uh, the keys, the elevator. So if I'm a, if I'm. This is a haiku. No, <laughs> listen, listen. Let's paint a picture. I'm a woman in a, in a I'm negligee. I'm a second. Just yeah. Like, Imagine. Okay, go. I on. am. I'm a woman on the verge of a sexual encounter, and I'm. I'm wearing a particularly uh, erotic piece of lingerie. Mm -hmm. I'm not exactly in a state to be wandering around the lobby of a hotel room where passersby can ogle my breasts, boobs, and titties. Mm -hmm. But I have a certain gentleman coming over, and I want him to come directly up to my room. He cannot do that because you need a key to get into the elevator. Mm -hmm. You know what I do? I gotta wiggle down in that lobby, pop my head out of the elevator at specifically the right time. And usher him what's in. The, what's the? Caca. Yeah. The, ooh, ooh. Yeah. And it's um. I've been clocked. I've been clocked. And I never wear shoes because they hobble me. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You've clocked by who? Fans? No. 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 Hotel staff, guests, peepers. You know. And you're not have shoes on. I don't have shoes. I can I show you? Is it because you want to? But don't you? Wait a minute. Is this they the thing where you have no shoes you on, but you walk in your balls to your feet still? Oh, tiptoes. It's like. See, it can't. Yeah, it's like very, it's very uh, Scooby Doo. Scooby I would do a little more military. Like, <laughs> or, or like baseball, baseball. Oh, 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 oh. Oh. I'll say this too at hotels: don't look under the bed. They don't clean under the bed all the time. I once found a gray chicken bone. What well, was there any meat left on it? No, no and I was done with it. <laughs> um, Did you ever have you ever found um, drugs at a hotel? Found drugs? No. You haven't? No. Huh. You know, I, I leave them everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> I go into your room right before you get there. Um, I had a turd once. I know we don't like to talk about poop, but I was in a British hotel and I was there for four days, okay? It was a protract, it was in between, it was a, uh -huh. and the plumbing, the first day we got there, as soon as I got into the room, I had to do my business. I did my business and I flushed the toilet. Little did I know that that flush was not a plumbing situation. It was more of a, a, of a, sl a slight slap in the face of, oh, you thought this turd was gonna go away, did you? You thought that just doing that handle, that this modern uh, mechanism of plumbing would, would, would work. Yeah. I had to, I had to live with that turd or the remnants of it for the next four days because I'm too, too ashamed to call down to housekeeping and say I've got a turd in the toilet that won't go away. Never mind the fact that I had to add it to that pile in the pool. There were new members swimming as I had to defecate the next few days. Thumb the slices of the turd into the toilet one at a time. Julian turd. Ju <laughs> That's so. The only gripe I have I is hate that. Ooh, I can't believe I just participated in that conversation. I'm sorry. We can cut it out. <gasps> and you know what else I love? Oh, when the hotel room has a tea maker, tea bags, a kettle, a tea, no tea bags with like electric kettle. A in kettle. the UK, they all have kettles. Yeah. Oh, it's the only redeeming quality about the UK hotels. That's the true. Only one. They'll have a kettle before they before they'll have like a working toilet. Oh, hundred percent. Also, now I'm done. Six and a half inches of skin off the end of somebody's little ringer. I want to make some English breakfast after my English breakfast. Oh. A ringer? Yeah. <laughs> you think of all this, sh all the piss, all the stuff that is, you know, flushed down in the of war. Those cleaners probably touch 
every day. Don't leave someone with a crisis center. You know what I mean? No. Here's the thing, if you do, and I have, of course, obviously, I, so I take whatever tip I would normally leave and I triple it. And I usually write a thing, I'm so sorry. What's the normal tip? $10? Um, $5? Uh, well, it depends if it's only one night, two nights, you know what I mean? If it's one night, I will leave um, $20 or I will leave like, the most I've ever left is 100 Yeah. But that's like multiple nights. I Always mean, 20. I mean, it uh, has to be. I right. think it's important to pay everybody uh, a lot, but that's a lot. I I leave between five and 10 if I'm well, staying one night. But that's good, it's something. They, I just think about like, it's same with Uber, right? Someone's driving Uber. I just <laughs> them off. I just <laughs> them off and I swallow the <laughs> I drink the <laughs> I'll get in the car and I'll say, for Brian, and they go, yeah, and I go, can I? Yeah. Can I drink your? <laughs> and they go, no, no, please. No. If you um, go to a motel or hotel, yeah, which you could always come to the Trixie Motel in Palm Springs, California, opening later this year. And a, a quick question: Is a motel? What's the difference between a motel and a hotel? Jury's still out on that. Don't know. But I assume one was motels. <laughs> hotels better, but that's not the case. I think it also has to do with size. Is it just flat? The Trixie Motel seven rooms. Mm. So like, yeah. you can't call a hotel seven rooms. Like the Beck Motor Lodge. Oh, love. I think that's probably a motel. A motel is also, you know, rent by the hour. Do you guys rent by the hour? Uh, yeah, I saw a, at the Beck's Motor Lodge, I was going up to my room and I saw a guy with the door open, legs up like this. <laughs> fell. Oh. Legs up like this and he was, Hold on, door okay. open, yeah, Hold door on. open, and I didn't know it was a hookup hotel. I never know when things are a hookup hotel until I, I get too late. fully two fingers inside me, and I'm like, this isn't a Best Western. This isn't 106. I was at your party and I was like, anyway, happy birthday. And I felt my skirt get pushed up. Yeah, my skirt, <laughs> my skirt got pushed up as somebody put it. <laughs> somebody put in a cease and desist. Uh, my skirt got pushed up as somebody put their big <laughs> in me. <laughs> you gotta do porno, mama. I know. You gotta do it. Cinemax, where's the call? I wanna, here's what I wanna do. Where's One day call? I wanna come into set and you're already sitting here and you're exhausted and you're tired and I, I, I run in like this. I just had sex. <laughs> and then that's how I explained I was late. I just had sex and you go, how was it? And I go, it was good, hit, hit record. <laughs> oh my.